Ever wondered why asteroid sampling is so crucial to our understanding of the universe? As we stand on the edge of an unprecedented era of space exploration, we find ourselves increasingly drawn to the mysteries of the celestial bodies that populate our night sky. Among the stars, planets and galaxies, there exists a class of celestial objects that often go unnoticed, asteroids. These seemingly insignificant chunks of rock and metal, scattered across our solar system, hold keys to the deepest secrets of our universe. Asteroids, remnants from the dawn of our solar system, are like time capsules, untouched and unaltered for billions of years. Studying them can give us a glimpse into the very beginnings of our solar system. They provide clues about the materials and conditions that led to the formation of planets and even life itself. Asteroid sampling, a revolutionary technique in space exploration, enables us to directly study these celestial time capsules. By bringing back pieces of asteroids to Earth, we can delve into their composition, analyze their structure, and unlock the secrets they hold. This knowledge can help us understand the history and evolution of our solar system in ways we never have before. Furthermore, asteroids are not just scientific curiosities. They are potential resources rich in valuable minerals. Studying them could pave the way for future space mining operations, ushering in a new era of resource acquisition and helping sustain long-term space missions. But it's not just about what's out there. Asteroid studies also help us safeguard our planet. By understanding the orbits and compositions of asteroids, we can better predict potential asteroid impacts and develop effective strategies to prevent them, ensuring the safety of our home planet. To truly understand the significance of asteroid sampling, we need to look no further than one of the most ambitious space missions of our time. A mission that aims to reach out to an asteroid, collect samples and bring them back to Earth for us to study. Let's delve into one of the most exciting missions of our time, the OSIRIS-REx mission. September 8, 2016, marked a historic day for NASA. On this day, the OSIRIS-REx spacecraft, a marvel of modern engineering, blasted off from Cape Canaveral, beginning its journey to the asteroid Bennu. This mission, the first of its kind for NASA, aimed to bring back a piece of the ancient solar system for study. OSIRIS-REx, which stands for Origins, Spectral Interpretation, Resource Identification, Security, Regolith Explorer, had a clear set of objectives. It was tasked with mapping Bennu, a primitive asteroid that orbits the Sun, collecting a sample from its surface, and then safely delivering that sample back to Earth. The mission was not just about collecting a rock from space, but about understanding the building blocks of life, the history of our solar system, and potentially the origins of life itself. Bennu, the target of this mission, was not chosen at random. Approximately half a kilometer in diameter, Bennu is a carbonaceous asteroid that scientists believe contains the raw materials that were present when life began on Earth. It's like a time capsule holding the secrets of our universe's past. Now, let's talk about the spacecraft itself. OSIRIS-REx was equipped with a suite of five scientific instruments, each designed to achieve a specific objective. It had cameras for mapping and navigation, spectrometers to analyze the asteroid's composition, and a robotic arm to collect the sample. The spacecraft's unique touch-and-go sample acquisition mechanism, or TAGSAM, was designed to kiss the asteroid's surface, releasing a burst of nitrogen gas to stir up and collect the surface material. It was a mission unlike any other, with a spacecraft unlike any other. With the successful launch, the journey to Bennu had begun. And with it began a new chapter in our understanding of the cosmos, a chapter that would help unravel the mysteries of our origins and the early solar system. A two-year voyage through the vastness of space. That's what it took for OSIRIS-REx, our intrepid explorer, to reach the asteroid Bennu. This was no casual jaunt across the cosmos. It was a journey filled with challenges, each one a testament to human ingenuity and the relentless spirit of exploration. The journey began with a gravity assist from Earth, 
a clever maneuver that used our planet's own gravitational pull to slingshot the spacecraft towards Bennu. In September of 2017, OSIRIS-REx made a close pass to Earth, gaining speed and aligning its trajectory with that of the asteroid. This was a delicate operation involving precise calculations and careful timing, but it was executed flawlessly and our spacecraft was on its way. As OSIRIS-REx hurtled through the cosmos, it faced another challenge, the vast and unpredictable nature of space itself. Solar radiation, micrometeorites, and the extreme cold of the void all posed potential threats. But the spacecraft was designed to withstand these rigors. Its instruments were shielded against radiation, its structure built to resist impacts, and its systems engineered to function in the harsh conditions of space. Another unique challenge was the deep space maneuver. This was a critical phase in the mission where the spacecraft had to adjust its course to match Bennu's orbit around the Sun. It required firing the spacecraft's engines in a precise sequence, a task that demanded both accuracy and reliability. Yet again, OSIRIS-REx rose to the occasion, performing the maneuver with aplomb. The final hurdle was the approach phase as the spacecraft neared Bennu. This was a time of high tension, as the team on Earth had to navigate the spacecraft towards the asteroid, relying on limited data and dealing with the time delay in communications. But through careful planning and expert execution, they guided OSIRIS-REx to its destination. Finally, in December 2018, OSIRIS-REx reached its destination. After a journey of more than 2 billion kilometers and countless challenges, our brave explorer had arrived at Bennu, ready to begin its primary mission, to collect a sample from an asteroid and return it to Earth. But that, dear listeners, is a story for the next scene. The moment we've been waiting for, the asteroid sampling. In the vast expanse of space, a delicate operation unfolds. Imagine a robotic spacecraft, OSIRIS-REx, reaching out to an asteroid named Bennu. The goal? To take a sample, a tiny piece of this ancient space rock, and bring it back to Earth. It sounds like science fiction, but this is precisely what happened in the OSIRIS-REx mission. Let's take a closer look at the sampling process. The spacecraft didn't land on Bennu. Instead, it performed a maneuver called a touch-and-go or tag. In this intricate dance, OSIRIS-REx extended its robotic arm, the touch-and-go sample acquisition mechanism, or TAGSAM. It's a fascinating piece of technology, something like a reverse vacuum cleaner designed to stir up and capture the asteroid's surface material. With precision and control, the spacecraft descended towards Bennu. Once the TAGSAM made contact with the asteroid, it released a burst of nitrogen gas. This gas agitated the surface of Bennu, lifting particles and small rocks into the TAGSAM's collector head. In just five seconds, the sampling process was complete and OSIRIS-REx fired its thrusters to back away from the asteroid. But the mission was far from over. The next challenge was to make sure the sample was safely stowed. The spacecraft had to perform a spin maneuver, essentially twirling around to measure the change in its momentum. This ingenious method gave mission scientists a way to estimate the mass of the collected sample. Sampling an asteroid is no small feat. The team faced numerous challenges, from ensuring the spacecraft could handle the harsh conditions of space, to navigating Bennu's rocky and rugged terrain. But they overcame these obstacles with creativity and determination, opening up new possibilities for space exploration. The samples collected by OSIRIS-REx are more than just rocks. They're a time capsule from the early solar system holding clues about the origins of life on Earth. These precious fragments could help us understand the building blocks of life, the nature of asteroids, and the history of our universe. The sampling process was a crucial part of the OSIRIS-REx mission, a testament to human ingenuity and the power of scientific exploration. It shows us what we're capable of when we reach for the stars and reminds us that even the smallest sample can unlock big secrets. With the precious cargo secured, it was time for OSIRIS-REx to return home, a journey back home carrying the secrets of the universe. 
As Osiris Rex embarks on its return journey, it is not alone. It carries with it a precious cargo, samples from the surface of asteroid Bennu. These samples, the first of their kind to be returned to Earth, hold the potential to unlock the mysteries of our solar system's formation and the origin of life itself. The anticipation within the scientific community is palpable. The return journey is not without its challenges. The spacecraft must navigate through an intricate dance of celestial bodies, guided by the precise calculations of its ground team. It's a testament to the marvel of human ingenuity and the relentless pursuit of knowledge. As the Earth slowly comes into view, preparations for the landing process begin. This is a delicate operation, one that requires precision and careful planning. The sample return capsule containing the precious asteroid material is released from the spacecraft. Protected by a heat shield, it descends through the Earth's atmosphere, its blazing trail a sight to behold. Once it has safely traversed the fiery descent, a parachute deploys, gently slowing the capsule's speed. As it nears the ground, a radar altimeter measures the distance to the landing site, ensuring a soft touchdown. Ground teams stand ready, their eyes trained on the sky, waiting for the capsule's arrival. Upon landing, the capsule is quickly retrieved, its contents still pristine from their long journey through space. The samples are carefully secured, ready to be transported to laboratories where they will be studied in detail. It's a moment of triumph, a successful conclusion to a mission that spans several years and millions of miles. This is a monumental moment, not just for the OSIRIS-REx team, but for humanity as a whole. For the first time, we have successfully returned samples from an asteroid, bringing us one step closer to understanding our place in the universe. The story of OSIRIS-REx is a testament to the power of curiosity and exploration. It's a reminder that even as we stand on the Earth gazing up at the stars, we are part of a larger cosmic journey. And with every discovery, every question answered, we come a little closer to understanding the grand tapestry of existence. On September 24, 2023, Osiris-Rex successfully landed back on Earth. We celebrate this achievement, but we also look ahead. For the journey is far from over. The secrets carried by Osiris-Rex are yet to be revealed, promising to illuminate our path as we continue our exploration of the cosmos. The success of Osiris-Rex has opened a new chapter in space exploration. Indeed, the successful mission of Osiris-Rex, where it collected and returned samples from the asteroid Bennu, has not just given us invaluable scientific data, but also the confidence to go further. As we stand on the brink of a new era, let's delve into what the future holds for asteroid sampling missions. Upcoming missions are set to take our asteroid exploration to the next level. One such mission is NASA's Lucy, named after the ancient human ancestor, the first to embark on a journey to the Trojan asteroids. These are a group of asteroids trapped by Jupiter's gravity. The mission aims to explore these remnants from the early solar system, hoping to uncover secrets about the formation of planets. Following Lucy, we have NASA's Psyche mission, which is set to explore the metallic asteroid of the same name. Psyche is unique as it is believed to be the exposed core of an early planet that lost its rocky outer layers due to violent collisions billions of years ago. Studying Psyche will provide us with an unprecedented opportunity to learn more about the building blocks of planet formation. But it's not only about exploration, Asteroid sampling also holds the key to understanding the potential threats these space rocks might pose. A mission in the works, the Near-Earth Object Surveillance Mission, is set to identify and track asteroids that could potentially impact Earth, ensuring our planet's safety. Moreover, the future of asteroid sampling also lies in the advancement of technology. The success of OSIRIS-REx has shown that robotic spacecraft can perform complex tasks such as sample collection with precision. This achievement paves the way for more advanced robotic missions that could go even further into the solar system, collecting samples from even more distant and exotic celestial bodies. And it's not just about the technology within the spacecraft. 
The rise of AI and machine learning algorithms could lead to spacecraft that can make decisions on their own, selecting the best sites for sampling and maybe even conducting preliminary analysis of the samples on board. The future also holds the possibility of commercial asteroid mining. As resources on Earth become increasingly scarce, asteroids rich in minerals and metals could become the mines of the future. Companies like Planetary Resources are already laying the groundwork for this space-age gold rush. The success of OSIRIS-REx has shown us that the stars are within our reach and we are just beginning to uncover the mysteries of the cosmos. Indeed, the journey has just begun and the future of asteroid sampling holds promise of many such exciting ventures and discoveries. As we continue to push the boundaries of human knowledge and technology, who knows what wonders we might uncover next?